we're just going to take just a moment and we're going to single you out so would you tell us and we'll repeat what you say because we'll be able to hear it would you tell us something that you usually don't let yourself do that you would like to do just one thing just just a couple of words yeah more time for yourself no more time for myself uh, in doing things I love to do so that's what we're asking you what do you love to do what do you deprive yourself of maybe that's the easiest way for you to hear the question what are you depriving yourself of what is the subject in which you practice your martyrdom the most <laughs> this is the subject what are you depriving yourself of for the benefit of others who don't appreciate it anyway and you know it little brats <laughs> you're sacrificing so much what are you depriving yourself of? What do you want? What activity that you could do on a daily basis? What are you depriving yourself of? Um, dancing again. Yeah. Dancing. She said again. Dancing. Dancing. That's a big breakthrough because please do not let us catch you dancing. <laughs> you don't even have a good excuse you don't have a good excuse it's an excuse that you've gathered up and brought with you what about you she wants to dance what are you depriving yourself of we know there are a lot of things that a lot of you are letting yourself do this is an allowing group you're doing so much better than the general population but you could do so much more for yourself what are you not letting yourself do that you want to do i would like to say no to the roles that others want me to play that i don't want to play all right, so that was a back ways into that. I want to say no to the roles that others want her to play that she doesn't want to really play. So is it that you want more time? No, I... Not more time. I want... I want other people to stop bossing me around with their minds. <laughs> I want to stop letting people control me through my expectations of them. Not one of them has any power over you, but your belief, there's something that you're doing that is keeping you from letting yourself do what you want to do. And so you've got this feeling of martyrdom going on to some degree or another, and you're blaming others when you are free to do more of those things. And if you would pick one and do it, and then pick another 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 and do it, and, another and, do it, and notice that the world doesn't come to an end. In fact, more things start going your way, the more you let loose of that restriction, and the more you allow yourself to go in the direction of satisfaction where your inner being is calling you, which is to say, the more you calibrate to your inner being, and what's in your vortex and the less you calibrate to those who are trying to assign things to you then the freer you will feel the more you will love them the more they will love themselves the more they will love you you can't get around this the law of attraction is a real thing and you are extensions of source energy and you're being called to things that you're not letting yourself go toward because you think you're too busy or because that's too frivolous or because there's not enough time or, 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 and none of that's true. That's all just momentum that you've built up with habitual thoughts. So that's what we meant earlier when we say it's not big things that screws up your life. It's those moment to moment decisions that I could do this, but I should do this. I could do this, but I should do this should what's the criteria for should we would like you to shift your criteria for should my inner being thinks it's a really good idea my inner being thinks it's a really good idea for who for me and therefore for everybody I know if it's good for you and you let yourself do it you're now tuned into source energy and anybody that has anything to do with you will benefit by the connection that you have accomplished because you've stopped resisting just out of habit what about you what do you want to do what have you been depriving yourself of that you want to do I want more, I want time. more time for myself Her kids need her. She's got two kids that need her. And so what she wants to do is more, more what? What does that feel like? Is it less activity or is it less worry? Because it's the worry that is in your vibration more than the activity. 
it's a stronger thing that you're playing less responsibility less responsibility is something that's popping up all over the room i want less responsibility no you don't you like doing things you like accomplishing it's not less responsibility it's less feeling that i don't get to choose when you do there's all kinds of things that you could choose to do on a daily basis that you don't choose because it's stuck in your vibrational craw that you don't get to so you don't even though you could if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next